So these cool pieces. Holy smoke. This is good. This could be real good. Alright. Nice. Look at this. everybody in this video you get to see two different units i think i paid 160 and 180 dollars for each of the units i want you to let me know in the comments which one you guys think is better don't forget leave a comment let me know which units you think is better take a look both units they both have some surprises you never know what you're gonna find hey everybody how are we doing today robert's neighbor auction there extraordinary second sense auctions and i bought this unit for 160 dollars online storage and I had a 10% buyer's premium, so I got $176 on it. It was close, I haven't bought a unit for here a long time, and really, I'll show you the few things I saw, so why I bought the unit. You know, you just never know. Sometimes 160 bucks is better than going to the casino, better than buying lottery tickets. At least I know I'm gonna get something back out of that $160. So let's take a look inside. You gonna subscribe, it's free. Easiest thing to do, subscribe, hit that bell. You can see all the awesome units that we buy, quarter houses, and you never know what we're gonna find. All right, so I purchased this unit a couple reasons why. One, I saw this Pioneer, and Pioneer, great name in electronics. Pioneer, they could have money if they bought stuff that was Pioneer. Could just be an empty box they used. There's lots of bags, and then this, you know what that is? Is it a lockbox? No. This is a cooler. And it's an electric cooler. Plug it in. And it keeps stuff cold, but you never know where you're going to find an electric cooler. You might find food and some Himalayan pink salt. Nice. You ever have Himalayan pink salt? Every day. I have. Not bad. So that's a Coleman electric cooler. I have a bunch of bags in the unit. Looks like we got shoes. Shoes! So this is a little gamble unit. And uh, like I said, it was close. There's lots of stuff in here. So, so far it's a bunch of ladies shoes, which is a good sign. Because if you had a lady in here, we might get some jewelry. Who knows? You don't know. So you go through it, right Shane? Mm -hmm. So this lady obviously bought some stuff at Goodwill. Not my favorite place to see people buying stuff from. Um, there's something inside the hat. Mavericks, look at that. You love cigarettes and a lighter. Yeah, lighter's kind of cool. Cigarettes, not cool. Right, Chachi? He's just laughing up there. Looks like a purse. Pretty nice little purse. We find lots of money and other things in purses. So. Man, I, I'm what's behind the wall of stuff. What do you think, Shane? Um, hopefully more totes. <laughs> hopefully more totes. Right, we got a little toolbox down here and oh, fishing pole. I was not expecting that. And that's an expandable fishing pole. That's pretty much priceless. Take it anywhere you need to go. Leather totes. Speakers. And ooh, what do we got here? Dun, dun, dun. All kind of different. At least it's not all bootlegs. That's a good sign. These are good speakers right here, KLH. There's another, here's the other part of it, bookshelf speakers. I'll we'll find a few things. I don't know, this is brand new. Oh, oh, ho, ho, ho. Hold on. This could be a good sign right here. Oh, brand new. Pop up tent. Instinct. Instinct is Gazebo. $60 price tag. That's half of my money in this bag. Let's see what else we can find. I like brand new stuff. Now the question, let's see this, what's in this Pioneer box. I don't even know 
always behind us. Oh my gosh. Keep a good sign. Is this some kind of like stand or something? Oh, it's heavy. It's heavy. There's something in here. Oof. What is this? What is this? Is this the, in the hold? It's a, a tabletop stand. Tabletop stand for what? TV? Tabletop stand for plasma display system. Interesting. The real reason I bought this unit is because of this right here. Shane wanted one of these. No, I'm just joking, but what the heck's inside? Oh, 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 oh no. Shane, don't be looking. Don't be looking, Shane. This is a lot of adult stuff and uh, football life of Barry Sanders. How did Barry Sanders get stuck between, well, let's just say a rock and a hard place. I have no clue. And there's some DVDs in there. You never know where you're going to find a storage unit. We all know where they Like this. Let's say a nice little $40 patio umbrella. All this stuff. Hey, we're adding up. Definitely going to make our money back. The question is, how much money? All right, we got all these totes in here. Probably gonna be clothes. Just because the person had a lot of clothes. We definitely got clothes, clothes. And uh, there's money in clothes. So we'll have to go through them. Look for vintage clothes, t-shirts, jeans, leather coats. All right, all clothes, you know. So we'll go through this stuff. We gotta get rid of some of this stuff, I mean. Look at this thing. Looks like it's brand new. A tilting tailgate TV mount. Remember, you want the chassis? You wanted one of these for Christmas. Merry Christmas, chassis. Hey, I appreciate it. So all these clothes, clothes, clothes. I mean, there's just tons and tons. So hopefully we'll find some jewelry and stuff in here, but we'll be searching all this to the bottom. We got shoes. Holy clothes and clothes and clothes and clothes and clothes, but. There's so much, you just never know. We're gonna have to search everything. This is kind of a strange bag here. And, uh, I mean, it's definitely big, it's heavy. Now we gotta find a, a zipper. Must be on this side right here, here we go. As soon as it's gonna be more clothes, but you never know. Oh, yeah, look at all these jeans, shoes, boots, clothes, clothes, and, uh, Diapers. Okay. We got a few new things out of here. Look at this. Brand new cast iron enamel Dutch oven. So that's the weird thing. Is it's a you know that's a closed, closed, empty tote. Empty tote. And there's some nice bugs in here for sure. Somebody out there would love. Units you know, like this. I mean, this lady's clothes, clothes. Look at all these clothes. There's tons of hangers back there. See something back there, Shane. I can't make it out. Ooh, there's some camouflage up here too. Just gotta keep it. Got a nice camo jacket right there. American stitch. Medium. Very nice. Definitely close. Close. I don't know what's in here. Oh. Looks like hair, Shane. Oh, well, you know what they say in this business. Hair today, gone tomorrow. Oh, we got right there. Got a portable AC unit. Got a fan. Oh my gosh, there's tons and tons of suitcases back here. Hopefully she put the good stuff in the suitcase. Starting to make a dent in the unit, but holy hangers. I got you know. Should I say, I'm hung up. Why did I touch those chairs? I don't know. One for punishment. Stay. Whew. Now we got a bag here. Oh, here we go. Here's something that's not close. Got more CDs. 
got a big old extension cord. And then all kind of brand new CDs looks like for burning. What's in here? Uh oh. Oh, it's candy. Woof! Never know what you're gonna find in a crunchy sock. Let's see here. CDs. So I don't know if this guy was, I guess, burning CDs. Selling them. Him or her. We found a mainly female clothes, so there's some male stuff. What's inside these little pieces? Holy smokes. This is good. This could be real good. Alright. Nice. Look at this. Whack and Decker power pack. So looks like we got the saws all. Looks like the vacuums in here. The drill. Saw. So that's a nice little case. Black and Decker. Power pack case. Oh, right here. A hunting seat. Got a bunch of wires in there. Oh, the things broke off. Still cool. You can take a seat wherever you want to go. All the CDs. So, lots of CDs. A little bit of everything we're finding over here. Starting to add up some cash. Nothing too crazy. Oh, man, more clothes. Paper bag. <laughs> Brand new. There's another $20 bill. There's like suitcases everywhere. Never know where you find suitcases. Dun -dun. Suits or just cases. More clothes. A cooler bag. It's got clothes and some other stuff in here. Stapler. Fix a flat. Oh, shoes. Brand new fit. Oh! oh, oh. Oh, oh. Hold on, hold on. Oh, it's a pump action. Ooh, there's a BB in there. Fire, okay, we got that. Let's pump this up. Oh, did you hear that? Mm -hmm. Did you hear that, Josh? Come here, Josh. Don't worry, I'm a dead shot. Oh, smoke. Man. Oh, there's other stuff down here, too. Uh-oh. Could have a surprise back here. We'll have to keep looking. Brand new ceiling fan. Another brand new ceiling fan. Brand new garment rack. Who knows what else we're going to find. You know, it's getting more and more interesting. All right, we're making some progress. Let's see what else we got in here. What the? Oh, brand new. There's the charge, a little light in there. There's an the air compressor. So a few things worth money. Hefty bags. You can always use those. Ooh. Oh, look at this. Look at this. I see jewelry. Oh yeah, there looks like a bunch of jewelry in here. I don't know what happens is on it. Watches, necklaces. There's definitely jewelry down here. It just takes a gold ring or something. Make it all worth a little while. There's definitely a bunch in here. Can't go through that right now. But yeah, there's you know, jewelry down here. What kind of stuff inside this little box of fun. Oh, car vac, radio. Little roller for paintbrush. So some usable stuff. What's in the tote underneath it? Oh my. 
Remix. Looks like all bills here, paperwork. So this looks like it's going to have a lot of the personal stuff in there. So we'll have to go through that. We've got another tote of fun. Man. Purses, boots, clothes, shoes. So we've got more cases in the back. We'll see what else we can find. Hopefully some more charge. Jane, look at this. Look, look. That is for 22 caliber pairs to be dismissed in. The barrel and the trigger right there. It's a bolt action. See how that's cut down like that? So that's interesting. We might find the rest of it in here. We already found the other pellet gun. More clothes. More clothes. Yeah, but we'll go through them all more as we get to the shop. Let's see a little blood pressure monitor, batteries, CDs. Uh, speaking of CDs, Gwen Stefani, Keith Sweat. This whole thing's loaded. This is all tools, car care products. Painting stuff. So definitely worth a few bucks. A couple more suitcases to go. Man, find a little bit of stuff here and there. It's definitely gonna make some money. Hey everybody, how are we doing today, Robert Zaba? Auctionaire Extraordinaire, and I'm at this location where I bought two storage units. The other one I paid $30 for and made tons of cash on that one. This one I think I paid $180 for and you know, hey, I took a gamble, I took a chance. I saw a couple things in there. Hey, I thought maybe would be some money there's tons and tons of boxes and totes so it looked nice and well packed nice and clean different from what i usually buy so hey gotta change it up a little bit so who knows what we're gonna find in here and the best way for you guys to see what we find is to subscribe it's free hit the bell get all your notifications you never know what you're gonna see never know what we're gonna find and we sell this stuff www.secondsense.com holy smoke oh man chatch is already quitting Look at Chachi, you was walking away. I know he's walking here. So, I saw like this, these are old knitted things. I thought maybe it could be an older ladies unit. Did some uh, crocheting and stuff like that. Oh, look at this right here. That's money. That's all brand new yarn. And it's, look at how well it's packed. This stuff's not cheap. So that, that bag's money. Look at this. More. Brand new. Boom. Stacking up cash. Just like that. Troll blankets. A lot of this stuff clothes and things. We'll donate things. Oh, that's a little pressure cooker. This whole box. You gotta be kidding me. It's all... Look at this. You know how much money's in here right now? This is all yarn. I mean, look at this. All brand new. how they were using it. So this box right here, I don't know the exact cash is on it, but it's kind of, we work some dough. <laughs> Alright, this looks like some kind of brand new, I have no clue, table or something. Oh, that's that's like a, what a, one of those you slide the thing on the table, like game or whatever. What the heck is that called? No, I think this is something you put together. Oh yeah, no, it's definitely not what I was thinking. Yarn, yarn, underwear. <laughs> These are the kind of things I like right here. Could have jewelry. In there. Looks like you might have some perfume. Perfume's always nice. Yeah, we definitely got some perfume, body sprays. foundation. No jewelry yet. These two are like professional crocheters for sure. Wow, that says $30. $25. So I'm assuming that's what's in there. Brand new lamp. It's a brand new lamp for it. I guess not $25. Maybe it was worth $25. That's why they bought it. It says DVD movie. 
Holy movies. There's definitely lots of kids' movies in there. Hopefully, we'll find some video games. A tote of video games like that. We'll pay for the unit quick. Um, oh, nice. We got the Black Panther mask. It looks like maybe it's a Cobra or something. There's all kind of costumes in here, like a ninja costume or something. So, perfect time. Oh, Wolverine. So, who knows? Costumes for sure. Let's see what else we got. This one says towels. And it is towels. And uh, towels always sell well. People need towels. So this lot right here. Get 20, 40 bucks for a lot like that. I don't know. Let's say school stuff. A little camera. Save a puzzle. Holy smoke! Wow, wow, wow. Oh, right there. Right down here. There we go. We're seeing some jewelry. That's a good sign. That's marked right there. I don't know. That thing's just the name of a company, maybe. I don't know. But we'll definitely find jewelry. Rings. And look at all the all the jewelry over here. Look at more jewelry. That looks like a gold earring right there. Could be gold right there. Especially see how it's breaking right there. A lot of times gold's so soft, it feels like gold. That might be a gold earring. There's a diamond. And the whole thing is filled, filled. So this is probably the jewelry thing. But I mean that's all for a few in there. Probably forty, fifty dollars at least. Holy paper supplies. Oh my gosh, it's just full of markers, brands, brand new headphones, sheets, sheets, large pots and pans, large pots and pans, that one says glass cookware, so most of them seem to be on there. We gotta see what's inside this kids' toys. Keep moving back. Who knows what we're gonna find? I can't wait to see what's inside this thing. We got big old wardrobe boxes and Nothing too uh, fancy in there. So sheets and, oh, there we go. What is that? Dragon Ball Z or something? Digimon? Mm. That's what it is, yeah, Digimon. Digimon. Man, see, I'm hip, Shane. You didn't know I was so hip, did you? I didn't know. You want to know my hip song? I'm the hip hop, hippity hip hop, you don't stop. You just earned cool points. Always. It says kids toys. Okay. And they are small kids toys. And uh, not tons of value in here, unfortunately. But the pig. Priceless. I forgot the name of that show. I Peppa Pig. What is it? Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig? Mm-hmm. Peppa Pig? Yeah. You watch that show, don't you? In my spare time. In my spare time. You got lots of that. Heavy books. Oh! Newer line. Kids' books. Dr. Seuss and all. all right, let's get some of this stuff out of the way. We got lots of stuff to go through. More sheets and uh, more sheets it is. Linen, linen, linen. So, oh, what's this stuff? More linen. Huh. More brand new yarn. Boom, boom, boom. He said this is all money. It's one pound out there. You guys can tell me in the comments what it's worth, but this whole thing right here is awful, brand new. So, keep finding brand new yarn. Wonder what else we're gonna find. Book repair, lotions. Not much money in there. But only thing we gotta do is get to there. We'll see what's inside the drawers. Huh, empty. Yeah, nice little plastic sterilite part, but looks like it's got a little damage. Let's see what's in this coat. Now I want to see what's in this cabinet. Oh, that's a coat. That's heavy. Books, books, books. Too bad it wasn't full of comic books. I see Spider Man. The cabinet is just empty. I found a leg. 
a leg up on you, Shane. Yeah, leg up on you. No. Uh, I'll be happy. Oh, look at it. It's actually a display piece. Shane wants that for Zuma. It's like the what you call it lamp from a Christmas store. All right, yeah, fabric, fabric, fabric. Ooh. What's this? Oh, it's all electronic stuff. First, I thought I saw jewelry boxes. No fit watch, but we got tons of cables in here. You know what? We could use some good cables at the shop, you know? Mm -hmm. oh, that one's weird. Alright, what else we got in here? Empty. A bag full of bags. That's the first time that's happened to us. This is, it must be a, like a little bike kit in there. This is a cell phone case in the bag. It's a bag full of bags. I was getting excited when I first got this kit. Man, there's tons of electronic cords. All these cell phone cases. Weird. And that's just so many cords. We got one box down here. It's all taped up. Oh, it's heavy. Pictures. Pictures. Bet you there's pictures in there. If there's not, we'll show you guys. Alright, another. Oh, two cases here. Woo! Oh, come on, come on, come on. This might be the good one, Shane. This might be the good one. Oh, it's upside down. Bath key. Axe. Tons and tons. Man, it smells good in there. So, hopefully it stinks. All right, come on, come on. Oh, I know I saw some stuff that looked like jewelry boxes. Tons of bags in here. Makeup stuff. Rubbing alcohol. My eyes to see my Flintstone vitamins. Fourteen karat gold. Oh, looks like sterling behind it. That looks like gold right there. See that little earring? That's probably gold right there. That's something. That's something. All right, I saw more. Don't worry. Got a watch. Right here, right here, right here. All kind of. Earrings and some of that stuff looks like it's sterling. Find a little bit of jewelry. We'll take it. All right, let's take a look at this big old box. Oh, did I smoke? More brand new yarn, yarn, yarn. Like I said, I paid $180 for this unit, and just in the yarn alone, I got my money worth it. Man, stuff. Stacked high, Chachi. Now, before we go over that high, let's move this box. I can climb up on the table and work my up there. This big old box. Say a bunch of household household stuff. Seasonings. Ooh. Love those seasonings. Right, I'm way up here. We got the old spin mops. I made a lot of money selling spin mops when I first started out. There. Lots of money. Looks like a. Bunch of pens. Ooh, nice. Some nice Bluetooth headphones. Those are worth a few dollars. Hopefully full money. Oh yeah, that's full money. Credit cards. <laughs> Got driver's license, everything. Do no money for us, Josh. Interesting. Oh, I gotta try to get this crazy. Oh. I don't know how I got up here. Oh, 
Don't try this at home. Train professional. All right. Household. Household. So we got matches back there. Got to move a few more things. See if there's anything good in this tote. And then we got a whole stack of totes right here. Oh, what's this? Brand new. The Black Heritage Trivia Game. Scrabble. Just some game shoot uh, candy lamp. Nice. Alright. Well, we got some Christmas fun in here. Interesting. This one says sheets and pillow cases. <laughs> Looks like toys. Yeah, the kids' toys in here. No sheets or pillow cases. Got a big old SWAT truck. Huh. No, just never know. It says clothes, and it's not clothes, but we found Batman! -na 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 -na. And a potato. So we got a bunch of stuffed plushes. Microwave in. Oh my gosh. I would have you just a microwave. Some kind of, look at that, brand new bed frame right there, a twin bed. So, this is our last tote. You buy a unit, you just never know what you're going to find. Never know what you get. You take a gamble sometimes. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose, and sometimes you get paperwork. All the paperwork. So, appreciate you all watching. Don't forget, check out all the other videos. Subscribe, like, hit that thumbs up. Appreciate you watching.